Hello once again, YouTube viewers. I'd like to address two very cool products in this video. One is going to be the Galaxy Camera, the EKGC100, featuring the 21X optical zoom capabilities. And the other is Microsoft's excellent Photosynth software. We'll start here underneath the Space Shuttle Discovery Orbiter. This is at the Udvar Hazy Air and Space Museum, part of the Smithsonian. This is the one out by Dulles Airport in Virginia. We're at 1x zoom right now, right underneath the tail of the orbiter, focused on this hatch. And as you see the shaded squares begin to appear, this is going to be each subsequent level of zoom. The squares are created by the Photosynth software, and this represents where another photo is overlaid. So I went to each zoom increment, shot another photo, and then overlaid them all in Photosynth. And you can see down here at the 21x level, that represents what we'll be seeing in full screen once we achieve that level of zoom. So I'll back up once again. You see I've got several photos that are all stacked. Photosynth does a nice job of merging them all together, and you'll be able to zoom right in here and get some excellent detail on some of the components inside the hatch here on the shuttle Discovery. I will put the full resolution pictures at the end of the video. You're going to see some resolution loss at the first part here because I did a screen capture using Microsoft Expression Encoder. And so you're not going to get the full resolution of what the camera is capable of right here. But you can also go to photosynth.net and look this up and you should be able to uh, enjoy the full capabilities of the software. This is a really fun thing that Microsoft has. Here we can even see some great detail on this piece of yellow tape with the edge beginning to peel back. Some things that you just can't see with the naked eye. Okay, now switching to full resolution, these are the pictures as they came out of the camera. Really nice detail here. You can uh, really appreciate why this camera is such an improvement over a cell phone cam. 16 megapixel CMOS sensor and also the optics giving you an equivalent focal length of 483 millimeters. Something you can pretty comfortably put in a jacket pocket. So it's a nice device to have at a place like this. Check out my other videos on my channel. I'll be posting new things as I stumble across them. I do appreciate you watching, and don't forget to subscribe.